Good morning. So what to do today? Um, what's top GUI shortcut keys for search? Right. Oh, that's right. Um, yeah, at the moment, the Snippet Bixi GUI doesn't have any shortcut keys for moving between things. You basically have to tap around um, or obviously click. Um, uh, so it would be good to, to, work, to add just at least these three things. You'll be able to just quickly add a new snippet. Um, probably toggle between the search and list with Control F. Um, and then just get to the settings page with something like Control Alt S, which I think is kind of, well, certainly a hotkey I've used um a few times before uh so yeah let's go for that um let's do that today right so what do we need well i suppose we need to get to go land and have a little look and then uh have a little play let's see how it goes Okay, so this is where we were last time, working on the CLI. Not doing that today. Uh, so we can drop all those things. Uh, collapse down CLI. Probably not going to be working on the daemon either. We're going to be working on GUI stuff today. Um, so let's have a... Let's get the dev version up and running. Uh, so what have we got here? We've got the daemon up and running. So we can go in to the GUI. Um, and we'll just do a Wales dev. Let's get it up and running. Okay, now I'll just take it across to... Um, workspace where my ID is. Um, so at the moment there are no hotkeys on this page. If I do control F it doesn't do anything, if I do control N it doesn't do anything, control Alt S, nothing. Um, I have to click around. I can use tab to get around. Um, but and obviously I can use I can use some Vim keys as well as like uh, page up, page down, so page down, page up, all kind of stuff that you'd expect on a list. Uh, kind of stuff, but no hotkeys. Um, and to get to the settings, I have to click. Um, I guess I could do that, and then can I hit enter here? Um, so I can focus and then use these things, but I can't use hotkeys. So that's the goal today. Let's use some hotkeys. Um, and I think in this mode here, which is um, the normal for editing snippets and so on, I think I want to make it so that by default you're in the list. And then hit Control F to search. Or do I? No, I don't. Maybe not. No, maybe it's quite good. Bin in here and then hit tab. And or control F once we like that. Yeah, no, I'll, think I'll leave it as is. Okay, let's move it across here. Make it a bit smaller. Um, okay, now I've done some hotkey stuff on the list, um, sort of. So let's go steal some code from there. Um, that would be... Possibly snippets list. 
Yeah. Okay. So this is based on quite handle navigation. Uh, so that's an on key down. Okay. So I'm using that on the unordered list. That is the basis for this. When as soon as you hit a key, I check it. So I need to do something like this, but at a higher level, which is interesting, especially when it comes to the list, which already takes that on. <laughs> so we'll see. Um, hmm. Okay, I might be good because I'm doing this. If I handle the navigation, so if one of the list key, if I do a key thing on the list that we understands, I do it and then I prevent any further. So that might be fine. I might be able to do something similar at a higher level. Hmm, we will see. Okay, uh, where are we going to do this then? So in the front end, we do have app, but that seems a little high. We probably want to... Hmm, we do main screen. We do have screen, of course. Ah, that's perfect. Okay, All right, okay. We already have a handler in here. for doing the cancel stuff. Hmm. But how do I say... No, I need to be careful here. These hotkeys only apply on a per screen basis. So you have to be in the main screen there in order to do a okay, gate, or I want to do an ad, or a snippet, or I want to switch between search and blah, 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 or I want to get to the settings page. Okay, yeah, I need to be careful there. So, Let's think, so main screen. Hmm, there's also the welcome screen. Which I need to revisit at some point because I haven't looked at that in a while. But we'll come back to that. Let's do main screen. Uh... Okay. I'm going to do it on a per page basis. I was thinking of doing add, doing like a control N at this level, where it could be this screen or the welcome screen. 
but what if we add another screen and it doesn't make sense? Stuff like that now, we'll do it in here. Okay. This will be interesting though. Yeah, it makes sense though. If we've got a search box, we've got an ear. Yeah, okay. Uh, right. We will need something to anchor these off to catch the event. And I think. Hmm, this might not work. I might be in trouble here. Okay, I don't think I can do this. Well. Key up. Uh, what was I calling these? Handles. On key up. And on key down, okay. Okay, it's got pinged for something. So let's do Hmm. Handles. I will do well, first of all, let's clean that out. I will do a new function at the bottom, I think. Can always move it. Probably never will. Anyway, uh, so on key up, we'll get an event. Yeah, fingers aren't working yet today. We'll do. Something like if event um, well, I did have in the snippets list it says 
Where is the control stuff then? Control key, okay. Let's do if event. Control key and event key, is that right? Yeah. That is equal to n oops. Let's try just well at the moment we do handle add snippet and event prevent default this could be a bad idea i'm not sure we're going to get the key up though i can't remember whether that works on custom components or not Possibly not. All right, did that do its thing? It did, didn't complain. So in here, if I do control N, nothing happens. Okay. I have a feeling that's because I'm not bubbling it up here. How do I bubble when I've already consumed on that particular one? Hmm, I'm not sure how that works with Svelte. I've not had to do that before. I'm going to, need to look at the docs. Uh, we'll do we will do the docs docs, and Right, so if we get a click, we handed it, fine. Hmm. I think I need to look at the tutorial. Okay, that's a simple case.
Right, so what we've got to here is this is dispatching so in the outer we are we've got an inner component which dispatches message so it goes do a click and it says yo hello then outer just forwards the message to the app and then the app goes yep I'll have that thanks but I want to forward to Dom once which is this, but I've already consumed it. So... On-click handle. Okay, and then we've gone to the next chapter. <clears throat> Okay, um, let's have a little play then, see what we can do. So at the moment, screen is doing an on key up. Which doesn't have to do for that. I'm good to escape. What this does is if I hit there and I hit escape, he says, Oh, I think I've broken things. I used to go back. Uh, maybe it's for edit then. Huh. Is settings not... Oh, settings isn't a normal screen. I have to look into that. Um, it's pinged again. <laughs> Okay, I just need to deal with this, so I'm just going to be off for a second. Uh, if I can remember what my number
Right, turn them back. Okay, just helping someone out there. Uh, right, okay, so back to business. I need to... find a way of re-throwing the event, I think. The alternative, and what I could do, is I could do I change this to key down. Just this is going to be a bit of a test. Oops. And then we still have. One key up there. We'll see actually whether this makes a difference because I have a feeling I might have hit a limitation in Svelte. Hmm. Because it's on a component. Could be a problem. The only other way maybe I just need to do this. So I'm now gonna bubble on key up. And we'll see what happens then, whether it then catches it here. Uh, so that should compile now. So control in. That does work. OK. Can I clash them? If I... What happens? This is a bit of an experiment. <laughs> so what if I do up? Oh. It's not happy there. I wonder if that's going to have a compile error. No. So can I still do escape? I can. Can I do control N? I can. Can I do escape in here again? I can. Huh. Seems a bit risky, but 
I would prefer that the escape is happening not on the down I'm holding at the moment, but on the up. I'm going to keep that for a bit and we'll see what happens. Because that's quite useful. So it seems like I'm hoping what happens is it tries that one and then tries that one because of the ordering. But I don't know whether that's guaranteed or not. Um, we will see. It seems to work anyway. So I'll just save that again and I'll just give it a quick test. So I could be, can I be in here and do controlling? No, good. So it's not, it's definitely doing it in here and it's not doing any weirdness. Um, it's also not doing escape there anyway. But. Okay, right, anyway, so I can be in here and do control and yes, cool. Um, let's do, what else do I want to do? Search, control F. This will be interesting. Well, hold on. Let's do the easy one then. Settings. Uh, that's going to be a duplicate of this. But I want it to be event dot result. And then S. I think that's what I said, wasn't it? Control Alt S. Okay. And we'll just do handle settings. Okay. So if I'm in here and I'm in the list and then I go, oh, I think I want to change the settings. Control Alt S gets me there. Can't get back. Well, that's interesting. Can now. Hmm. Okay. And then I need to do Control F to toggle. So that's going to be the interesting one. What I want to do. Is if I'm in the list, control F puts me in the search box. If I'm in the search box, I want it to put me in the list. Not sure how that bit's going to work. Uh, so. What we do what we should do first is I'll grab that so control F and I guess we should just do a toggle between search and list. Nice. 
simple function. So it does what it says on the tin, hopefully. We ever get it to that. So do we want to decorate it or just test? And how will I know what's got focus? Okay, I need to track it, don't I? So, on the input, I do a uh, on is there a focus? Yes. We'll bubble that. And then we will also need to do the same on the snippets list. So we really have on focus. I've got an active flag on there. No, I don't want to do that. I was thinking about just exporting active, but I don't really want to do that. I think I want to just grab the focus. Um, event. So we'll basically duplicate this and then take out that we'll see i'm not sure if that's going to work or not um okay So on the input, what we'll have is a little variable for tracking. So let
just focused. Equal focus search box. So when we first come in, it's going to do that. It's going to say, in theory, that the focus is in the list. Otherwise, it's not. And then we'll just track. So we're going to put it here, I think, above. So we'll have a function Uh, on list focus. Don't care about the event. And we'll have list focused equal to true. And we'll have the opposite as well. On search focus, this list focus is false. So yeah, so we'll do in the search box on focus. <clears throat> When we do that, we definitely know we're doing a search focus. And on the snippet list on focus, we'll do on list focus and then as we're hmm. what are we tracking? We're tracking the search, aren't we? No, list. Ah, that's the wrong thing. Wrong thing. Okay. Let's do this. Search focused. That makes more sense. That's what we're trying to achieve. So we will, well, kind of. So search focused equals false whenever we're on the list. And true. And 
there. We also need to do Hmm. Yeah, I think I'll. I think I will keep it like this. But I was thinking of maybe tracking, whether we're on the list or not as well. But really, Control F is about the search box, and whether we're on it or not. So. Toggle off is uh, just a bit of icing on the cake. So if we have focus there, I think we probably need to do a blur just as well, just in case. Um, Cause as we do have Do have focus in and focus out, but I don't think they're reliable. So I'll do on blur. I'm going to change that to search blur. And here we're basically saying, right, if we know we've just gone into the list, then we are blurring that. Otherwise, don't care about the blur because it's Control F, which is about search. Don't really need to track it coming out of the list and onto like a button or something. Don't really care so much. You have to tab. I guess we could put like another hotkey for a list. Mm. Because we could just probably just take, check which control has focus. Hmm. Okay, well, let's just do this for the moment. Can always improve it later. So on key up, um, toggle between. So here. Um, so if search focused, let's do the right thing here. Uh, now we're going to have to target these things, which is a bit of a pain. We 
don't have an anchor on that. How are we going to do that? Hmm. Problem is, I can't do this. He says, I'm pretty sure I can't do that. Uh, so if I call that. If I do that, and then I try and compile it, I should get an error. Because you can't add an ID. He says to a custom component. It's not complaining. Maybe it's silently failing. Interesting. I kind of expected that to fail. Maybe things have changed since I last used that. Can I do an ID now? Hmm. Oh, I know what I need to do. <laughs> right, okay. Um, I need to bind. What I need to do is bind Think I need to look at the docs. Pretty sure I need to bind. Uh, okay, I probably can't do it. A custom though. Hmm, what else can I do?
Okay. Interesting. Okay, so I can do it. Okay, a couple of things for it. Um, and then I mean I've got I've got focus I haven't. Let's try it. Um, Mm -hmm. Okay, let's do and well, we're going to do this probably. Here. Do this. This is the use thing, but I'm going to do this. I'm going to call it. There we go. All right. So that's my use thing. Um, so what it does is it takes a node, uh, whether you want to enable it or not. If you enable focus on it, it just does a focus. I suppose I could just do that. I could just do dot focus. That's a good point, actually. <laughs> Let's just quickly try that. <laughs> Didn't really need to do focus no, did I? <laughs> okay. Or do I? Hmm. 
Hmm. Okay. No, might be all right. Uh, so, search box dot focus probably should work as well. Yeah, good point. Let's take that out. I was getting a little bit ahead of myself there. We'll see. Think it should be okay. Do the simplest case first. If that doesn't work, then I'll have to do the slightly more complicated. Okay, so in theory, if we get on key up, control F, we will toggle and we'll check to see if search is focused. If search is focused, then we want to focus the list. Otherwise, we want to focus the search box. And we'll see. I'm not sure whether this is going to work or not. So we're in the search box at the moment. If I do Control F, it doesn't do anything. All right, I'm in the list now. Control F is coming forward. Did I do that? I don't remember doing that. Oops. <laughs> okay, I've done that as page down. Uh, okay. Hmm. Because I did the Vim keys. Control back and control forward. Okay, I don't think that's a good idea. That was probably a bad move. What I probably should do is down and up. Let's do that. And then it's not even needing control keys. And that gets around using control as hotkeys rather than list movement. Yeah. Down and up. Yeah. Try that. Okay, so if I go in here and I do Control F, it still doesn't do anything. Control F still doesn't do anything. Okay, it's not happy. I need to be checking the time there. Um, okay.
bit of an issue is that I can't test this in the browser <laughs> because Control F will be grabbed by the browser for search. So how am I going to do this then? Oh, hold on a second. I am not. No, I am preventing default. Okay, what I'll do is I'll I'll just do it to the dev console. Uh, now I've got to just remember what that is. There's a Wales command for that. Uh, info of some sort. Log info, that'll do. Uh, log info uh list search so let's even see whether it's doing what it's supposed to do. I'll take that across back to where stuff is. So I'm in the search box and I do control F, nothing. Control F, nothing. Okay, so it's not even attempting. All right, okay. Why? See if that does anything. <laughs> okay. So control F. Oh, I was definitely getting there. If I do control A, I do control N, definitely does it. Escape, control, and just one more, that's good. Control F doesn't even, that's so weird. Why would it get there? Let's move that down. Okay. Uh, 
Interesting. There's a failure somewhere. It's not happy. I wonder if it is this. Maybe I was... Hmm. Okay, what if... Take that out. Take that out. Maybe I had a good premonition on the problems of focus. Yep. Okay. So, yeah, it's trying to go to list there. If I go into the list, search. Yep. Trying to do, getting back to the search. If I do, if I go back to it, it's trying to get into the search again. Interesting. Funny ordering, actually. It's not consistent. Hmm. Okay, why? So there's a problem with this. Something strange going on here.
this. So, lost focus, not getting focus, lost focus, not getting focus. Click on this, cancel. Okay. Focus is not working. Right. That would explain a few things. So, what's the betting is a bubble problem? Hmm. Okay. I might have to do it that way. So we're going to check the focused property. Yeah, OK. Let's try that. So instead of this stuff, so search focused in theory matches whether the focus search box setting is correct first. I'm going to take out those two. And then I'm going to find Oh, that's a pain. You haven't saved it yet. Maybe I'll be okay. It's sussed it out. Okay, that's fine. Uh, 
And then don't do that either. Right, I've got two minutes and then I've got to go. So we should have control key toggle if search is focused right so we're just doing that test at the moment if i tab out oh yeah we're not doing any uh blurry stuff so control f would in theory try to take me to the search box if i'm back in it it tries to get it okay so that's working right good okay i just needed to bind to the quick thing the blur wasn't working because you needed to bubble it so i don't need that in the input anymore I think we're good everywhere else. And then on the list, got that changed there. What if we change down here? Don't care about that anymore. We're just changing those to event handlers. Back in the screen, try and do the focus. Okay. So, Control F still fails, still fails. Okay, so that's the bug at the moment. It won't do the focus. Okay, we all need to look at that. So, to do. This is failing and Likely causing error. Probably console error, but I can't tell at the moment. I still got that import. Uh, no. Yeah, I took it out. Okay. We'll come back to that. I've got to go. Uh, so, we have a bug that we need to fix to actually get the focus to switch. For whatever reason, the node not working there. It may be
Yeah, I might need to do what I was expecting to do before. Let's just quickly do that. I need to quickly test that because that's going to bug me otherwise. Him out. We'll use that use function. Not sure what's going to help, but it's worth a go. No. Still not happening. Eh, okay. Something to look into. That have to happen another day. Oh, well, we've got almost there. We've got some key handling working. Uh, it's just getting that focus working now. Um, hmm. I'd have to think about that. I'll have to try maybe on the browser. Let's see if I can. I'll just use a different key or something. Um, it doesn't clash with the browser. Control F. Um, and then see if I can try that down because that's a bit annoying. Okay, um, until next time, thanks for watching, you take care.